Right, imagine this. You pop into your local grocery store to buy a pint of milk and a packet of crisps, and you find the tills are running slower than a snail on sleeping pills. Why? Because hackers, yeah, actual cyber criminals, have hacked into their IT systems and pinched customer data. And not just a little bit, millions of email addresses, names, contact details, the whole shebang. This is not just a fictional report. This actually happened last week in the UK to the co-op. Now, co-op isn't alone. Harrods, Marks and Spencers, big brands, big breaches. The National Security Center called it a wake up call. And if you think it couldn't happen to you, think again. If they can get into a 141 year old British institution, they can get into anything. But here's the real kicker. When these attacks happen, everything grinds to a halt. It's a bit like going back to the Stone Age, but with fewer mammoths and many more angry customers. This is where companies get it wrong. They put all their eggs in one digital basket, one big shiny IT system. But when things get scrambled by hackers, they're left with nothing. No way to communicate, no way to fix the problem, and no way to tell customers what's going on. What they need is something called an out of band system. Think of it as an escape tunnel for your communications and your data. It's a backup network, completely separate from your main one. If the main one gets clobbered, you can still get in, fix things, and crucially, still communicate with your teams and your customers. Without a band, you're not stuck waiting for the IT cavalry while your business burns. You can log in, troubleshoot, keep the lights on, all without the hackers even knowing you're there. So to every company out there, stop thinking you're invincible. Get that secondary system. Because when the hackers come calling, and they will, you'll need more than hope and a stiff upper lip to get you through. Otherwise, you might as well hand your business over to the hackers and go and open a lemonade stand.